The Michigan Department of State has disqualified 15 candidates from running in the August primary election. The disqualifications were based on defects in candidates affidavits of identity, which is a broad term for many errors like missing information, false statements or non-compliance with the Michigan Campaign Finance Act. Of the 15 disqualified candidates, four were disqualified for missing information or information that shows the candidate is not eligible to run in the district, they indicated. Another 11 candidates were disqualified because of false statements concerning compliance with the Michigan Campaign Finance Act. According to the Michigan Secretary of State, these 11 candidates all had outstanding campaign finance reports or unpaid fines at the time they submitted their affidavits of identity. Now, all of these candidates were disqualified based only on their affidavits of identity, not the signatures they had to collect to get on the ballot in the first place. The issue of signatures will be headed by the State Board of Canvassers, and they'll decide whether candidates have enough valid signatures on May 26th. For now, I'm your Capitol reporter, El Myers, Fox 47 News.